Debo Samuel on Instagram took down his profile picture. Last night, he stopped following the 49ers. People were like, it's not a big deal. He still has his profile picture up. Boom, profile picture down. It was him wearing a Niner jersey. Now it's just blank. What do you think? I don't know. I'll tell you this, Grant. This younger generation, because I am 15 years older than Debo Samuel, and yes. I've had Instagram since its inception when you could only have it on an iPhone for people that, that don't remember how Instagram started. But this I'm 34, but I'm still not on it. It's a little intimidating. Keep going. Good for you, Grant. I hear you, man. Yeah. But here's the thing. For this younger generation, anytime something happens that's a minor inconvenience in any way, whether it be in a relationship with a friend or a relationship with your girlfriend or anything like that, the main thing that some of these people do is they don't necessarily delete the picture. You can archive it, meaning it comes off of your profile, but it goes it goes just away. But it doesn't mean it's gone, and you can bring it back at any time. Okay. So I guess what people are it wondering might be archived. I could come back. Yeah. But I guess what people are wondering is what spurred this on, right? Yeah. You know, because yeah. all of these rash decisions that young people make, like when you have an argument with your girlfriend, you really want to get, a, get back at your girlfriend, you take down all the pictures of you and your girlfriend and you archive them and you put them wow. away. Same, same wow. thing like when, when, same thing like when there's a guy who's interested on somebody, interested in somebody on Instagram and all of a sudden the pictures of you, her and her boyfriend are gone, then you slide into the DM. Is everything okay? I'm here for you. Like, I, I want to like, you know, so look. I'm not reading See, too I've much been into my this. wife since 2009, so I kind of missed a lot of this. But I thank you for explaining it to me. Yeah, I, I yeah. Look, I'm not reading too much into this at this point. Yeah, I think when when people were freaking out because I passed out very early last night, and I am so happy because people were freaking out last night about whether Debo Samuel unfollowed 49. I'm gonna tell you this: this is peak off season, nothing to talk about stuff, in my opinion. Like I just don't understand okay. why this this is something that everybody is all of a sudden like, oh my god, the sky's falling. Look. If 49ers fans are scared of something, it's not that he took the pictures down, is that this might be a DeForest Buckner situation. And that's right. really what they're that's all they're right. really worried about. Yes. Nobody should be worried about whether stuff is gone from his profile because Kyler Murray did the same thing. All of a sudden, a few weeks later, boom. Cliff's like, hey, he's back, we're back, we're gonna keep moving, and that's it. So I did Kyler get the bag? Not yet, but they will. They'll get they'll give it to him. Okay. They'll okay. give it to him. I don't okay. think I don't think that that's it. so again. I think just right now, there's nothing else to talk about. I mean, you're, you're going to do an entire show without talking about the big news today from the 49ers and the big signing they had, Marcus Johnson, wide receiver. Boom, there's your front office. Move in and get in free agents in here. Ha, take that, guys. But at the same time, this just feels like there's nothing else to discuss because we're waiting for the draft. You're kind of waiting for this shoe to fall where the extension happens. This comes across, and then 49er fans, as usual, take this as, everything's everything's on fire and it, it's like that dog in the meme this is fine type stuff i'm really not looking too far into this in my opinion so what you're telling me is that <clears throat> from the mind of a of a zoomer a generation z mm -hmm. person taking down your pictures on social media doesn't mean the relationship is over it just means you're mad it just means you're mad for you a day put them back up there you are put them right back you can put them right yeah. back up after you and your significant other talk about it. Hey baby, I'm sorry about what I said last night. I didn't mean that. Yeah, you know yeah. what? Me too. Boom, you're back in Boom, love pictures and you're fine back again. Yeah, I see. So like, it's, it's it's something you do to make the other party feel upset. And yes, and that's yeah. it. So right, yeah. so you have a big argument with your girlfriend, whatever. You oh. go back to you go back to your house and you go through her profile and all of the pictures of you two are gone. Oh. And you're like, this uh -oh. is yeah, like, argh, like you're like, you're like, oh, so yes. you want to play games? Now I'm gonna yeah. do the same thing, and I'm gonna okay. play games. One more thing I want to say about this unfollowing thing. Before podcasting and YouTube and all this other stuff paid the bills, this could be YouTube guys. Um, I used to have jobs. I never once followed my employer on Instagram. I used to work for Sennheiser, which is a, he True. a headphone company. Yeah, I never followed Sennheiser. I used to work yeah. at Best Buy. I never followed Best Buy. I don't feel like I don't understand the correlation between you not following your employer and somehow being upset at them. I don't care if I, I don't care. Uh, I'm not going to follow you. Just cut the checks. That's it. That's all that really matters. Make sure that that account that my account is filled on time. When you guys say you're going to pay me, I don't really care about the social media stuff. But you know, Debo's I didn't mean to make that like, like a high horse thing though. I'm sorry. But you I know, like Debo's like going to come out in like three months and be like, I wasn't even, it wasn't even about football. Why you guys got to read into it like that? Like, okay, you could have told us, but I think he likes us. Is, he, is it One possible more. he's just trolling? He was like, oh, look, yeah. everyone, everyone's like, look at my Instagram. Let me do this. Two things it could be. It could be trolling, yeah. and it could be um, a leverage play by his, his team. 
right? His agents like, you know what? Let's let's really up the ante on this so yeah. we can make it make it seem like it's a dire, more dire situation. Right. The public outcry would right. push this into overdrive, and now yeah. they would feel pressure to get this done. See, it's, it's a it's, move and a non move at the same time. It's a move. Exactly. We talk about it; they get the picture, but the player can be like, "Ooh, this has nothing to do with football at all. This is when about Debo Samuel, social when justice." Debo, when Debo Samuel gets to his press conference after they sign the extension, someone's going to ask him about that, and he's just going to be like, "Man, that's you guys running with it. You yep. guys going a little too far." Yeah, I, I can't. Like, I'm not trying to make this seem like. Oh, I'm too good to speak about this. I'm just trying to calm everybody down because, as usual, 49er fans are taking things to the absolute extreme. And at this point, something as simple as just this social media thing. And who the hell is paying attention to what Debo Samuel follows and everything as well, too? Like, was it even possible that he even followed them in the first place ever? Possible he never followed them. How right. could you even verify that? And who would know? And why would they know something like that? And why you, whoever it is, is digging around on this. Why are you doing this? Why are yeah, you evaluate so everything in your life? Calm down. Point. Yeah, let's yeah. let's you let's have better usage of our time as opposed to looking at who Debo Samuel is following on Instagram, guys. I am already <laughs> you get a hot hour time. I love when yeah. when waiters come to the table. Like, what are we having for dinner? You are not invited. So, <laughs> first of all, living <laughs> is waiters. I just feel like you know. No, how did you I get have, my dinner? I have Instagram. I don't follow any 49ers players. I follow maybe one player. You know, that's it. Maybe. I sure. think uh, maybe. I don't follow any players. I don't know what the hell is going on. Like, I don't know, man. It just seems I like. I don't follow people on Twitter all the time. It's never news. I don't understand. We're going to start doing you should that. Check like, I'm going to follow you. 